Hey, welcome everyone. We are having a night of sharing real results with real people, APL Go style. We were totally off the cuff. We're just going to be sharing some of our favorite drops, what we've experienced, maybe other people experiencing, maybe even some animal testimonials, human, right? Kids, elderly, all the things. Uh, before we get started, we just want to make sure that we know that these are our own personal results and experiences. Of course, we're an all natural product, so we're not trying to diagnose, attempt to cure, prevent, or treat any diseases or conditions. Always ask your physician for medical advice. So do we have any volunteers of maybe someone who would like to share first? I can, I can get it out of the way. All right, you <laughs> okay, Debbie, then Kevin. Well, my favorite one is brain, B-R-N. Not only is it the best tasting, in my opinion, but I think it works so well and fairly quickly. Um, after I quit work, I didn't have tasks and I didn't have a schedule and I didn't have this or that. And I lost focus and wasn't able to, I don't know, just I was in fog. So... When they came out with the brain, I thought, I'm going to try it. And within a week, I could tell a difference. And so then I was on it faithfully until I ran out. And I just kept forgetting to order it. And what a difference it made. I could tell that I was slipping <laughs> again. So, and I just introduced it to my husband. And he has had the same results. Thinks that makes a real big difference in your day-to-day -day planning and that kind of stuff. So that's my favorite. Mm, love that one. Yeah, that's a great one. Uh, great for anything cognitive, concentration, focusing, brain fog. I think we kind of forget too sometimes we when they're working and then you stop taking them, like you said, Debbie, and then you mm -hmm. realize, oh, maybe that was working. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for that share. I love that one. Do you have another one you would like to share or should we get Kevin? Um, I like re I, re I like relax. And if I took that from someone, I'm sorry. Um, I just think when we get in our hassle of everyday life, it gets so busy and out of control that sometimes we just need to let go. And relax is just enough to let go. Doesn't make you sleepy. Doesn't make you drowsy. It just relaxes you. Yeah, that's a great one. A fan favorite for sure. Yeah. yeah. Decompress, especially at night when we got to turn off that busy brain. It keeps going and going. Thank you, Debbie. You're welcome. Kevin, you have All right. Well, I'm going to I'm going to still say relax and beauty combined. Um, oh, yeah. They put me to sleep. There is something about the combination of those two drops that just get me to sleep nice and fast. And even if something wakes me up in the middle of the night, I'm not lying, tossing and turning, trying to get back to sleep again. I'm able to get back right to sleep right away. And then I wake up refreshed. I don't feel drowsy. There's no, uh, um, set it, uh, what's the word? Um, there, there's nothing in it that will, that will keep you to sleep artificially and you're able to wake up refreshed. Um, so, so those two together, relax and beauty combined. Yeah, those are great. Do you ever find yourself doubling up on them sometimes? Like maybe one isn't enough. If I've had a particularly stressful day or 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 if I've taken some of the drops too late in the evening, because I do find some of the drops give me lots of energy. And if I'm mm. like peeking out with energy just before bed, you know, there's only so many dishes you can wash to try to, you know, work that out. So then, yes, mm -hmm. I, 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 I double up. And, you know, I could say that's a rule with all the drops. Um, you know, it, oftentimes we suggest you, you take one or you take two, but. You can overdose. Some things, sometimes um, things are working strangely in your body and you don't know it and you just need more nutrients. So you just keep taking till they work. Yeah, love that. And you can't overdose. So, yeah. you know, don't be afraid to take that second or third one. I know that helps a lot, especially when sleep and people are like, well, one, it didn't work for me. And I'm like, just take a second one. I'm telling you, be like, mm -hmm. ow. Yeah, so yeah, good. Kevin, if you need more dishes, I have some at my house. <laughs> 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 okay, deal. You pay for the airfare and I'll do your dishes. Okay, Bob, that means it's your turn. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I use my $1,000 I got for the 
for the cruise to pay for Kevin's airfare. That's what I yes. <laughs> um, wow. So many of them. Of course, the big hitter was uh, slide, stop, and relax after the knee operation and having the swelling go down overnight. Second big one was uh, ice. Terrible heartburn from the medicine and the anesthesia. And five minutes, it was gone. Now... What I'm loving is I've cut my blood pressure medicine in half. Just came back today. We had some uh, visit, follow-up visit today. Blood pressure was at 110 over 65. Wow. Good job. What was yeah. it normally before? I would, the high end would be 150, 165, sometimes higher. And then, then the lower end was 85, sometimes 95. So, and that was on full blown, whatever the name of it is, uh, blood pressure medicine. And so I've been able to use the drops three months later, blood pressure's down, continue to use the drops, cut the, cut the, uh, the blood pressure medicine in half now. So now I'm going to check this carried out I'll probably carried out past Cancun and then I'll try to go completely off the blood pressure medicine and see if I can maintain after that and uh you I know I'm I'm pretty in tune with my body I can't always tell you in medical terms but I know feelings and energy that I get all the drops are doing something they're all doing something. And some of them are even helping the medication, mm -hmm. prescribed medication, uh, do a better job. And I think it's because we're cleansing our system and detoxing. I'm, I'm drinking more water, more water, because I'm detoxing with all, even with the drops, just detoxing all the garbage is coming out. And uh, yeah, it's uh, it's an amazing ride. I love that. And it didn't, some things you said worked uh, pretty quickly, like the slide and stop when your knee was full and the inflammation, you noticed that within a day or two. But that was overnight. That yeah. took before I went to bed, Narita, the, the Energizer Bunny came and, <laughs> and, and we didn't even know her then. Um, and uh, yeah, she's a big part of our life now, but overnight, yeah. three drops, you know, eight o'clock, nine o'clock at night get up at seven or eight in the morning and my, my leg had gone down 50% and all the redness was gone. And I'm going like, wow. Talk about probably almost all of them, but the ones that I think I am leaning towards um, would be alt. Uh, that's the first one that I want to talk about. That one is for allergies, um, respiratory health sinuses. So I, um, don't really have seasonal allergies until it is pollen season here in Reno. And you go outside right now and it's like yellow everywhere. Like the cars are just covered in yellow. You can see it in the air. And of course, with that comes the runny nose and the stuffiness and all that stuff. And all for me works wonders. And I know that it works great because I haven't had a single um, like coughing fit or anything like that, where I used to, anytime the pollen was in the air, I used to just like, you know, go through that whole thing. Uh, Will, my husband and the boys are all on it. It's one of those drops that we take every day, especially also being in Reno where it's super, super dry and the desert dryness causes, you know, the runny nose and all of that stuff. So Alt is definitely one for that, but I also love it for bug bites or um, itchiness, rashes, anything mm. like that. I have had um, chronic hives in the past and the alt and the beauty um, and our beauty skincare, those were the only things that worked to calm my skin, even like starting to put it on topically. I had crazy mosquito bites on my ankles from a bike race and a soccer game back to back, um, two weekends ago. And, and I'm very allergic to mosquitoes and my ankles just swelled up and I like, I licked it and I rubbed it on there. And then I put it in a little cup and dissolved the rest of it to put on later. And then I took the alt internally and I'm telling you, it works so much faster than 
cortisone cream or anything like that. It's a little sticky, um, but it just, it works fast. So I'm a super, super fan of alt. Um, and the other one that I wanted to talk about, and I know Jen, you probably have a really powerful testimonial about this drop. I don't know if that's the one you were going to talk about, but I want to talk about happy. Um, and it is our hemp seed based one. And I, I always say it's anything that you might take a CBD product for, you can take this one for. And I know people take CBD for pain, for mental health, for sleep, for addiction. And for me, I do struggle with anxiety. And so when relax isn't quite cutting it during the day, I will pop a happy in. And also for pain, because I have arthritis everywhere. I have a neck injury that then goes down into my hips and my knees and all of this stuff. And when the slide and the stop aren't cutting it, if I add a happy in there, mm -hmm. it's like my pain just sort of melts away. It doesn't ever, I've, I'm still not a hundred percent pain-free, but because of my drops, I'm like functioning. Right. So instead of being like an eight and a nine all day long, I'm probably like a two or a three. And when it gets to be a four, then I'm like, Oh, I think I'll take a happy and then it knocks it down to like a one. So um, that's one of the things I love about our drops too, is they're so versatile. Like you take it for one thing and it does all these other benefits. Like I never thought to take happy for pain, but then when I thought, okay, do, do people take CBD for pain? Yes. So let me try that. And it totally worked. So those are the two I wanted to talk about tonight. Oh, I love that. And that's, Perfect segue because you're totally right. There's so many uses. Even um, HPY is great for menstrual cramps and some female like problems and issues. So like you said, you just never know, right? Look at the botanicals and, and realize that they have so many benefits in our bodies. And I don't know, Jen, would you like to take it away next since uh, I know you did have a couple of testimonials you wanted to share? Right um, sure. I have lots that I can share. Um, so it's hard to pick. Um, but, um, yes. So my, my testimony around happy, um, involves dealing with addiction. Um, and so for me, it was, um, the missing puzzle piece, um, surrounding my alcoholism. Um, so I've been to rehab four times. I, I know it all up here. But um, I was having a hard time, been on all the medications that they could throw at me and um, still had a hard time with those um, weird cravings. Oh, she froze up. The two for you. Frozen. Addiction is, um, I was super excited about it. And uh, so it took probably a me being on, um, I take happy and power for women. Um, first thing in the morning, that's, um, that's one of my first ones that I take and, uh, it does something, um, right. So there's uh, dealing with addiction. There can be some hormonal pieces as well. Um, in my opinion. And, um, <clears throat> so adding in the power dealing with, um, regulating some of my hormones and the happy where it regulates, um, some of the chemicals in my brain, um, the, the dopamine and the serotonin levels, um, has truly been a lifesaver for me. Um, so now I'm over a year sober and, uh, I can't ever picture going back to that and I don't have the cravings. Um, they don't, they're not there. Um, and I'm telling you, like it, it was the missing puzzle piece for me. So, um, that, Um, I had to deal with my dog. Um, so we've already touched base on on the drops that I used, um, SLD, STP, and RLX. Um, this week, my one-year-old Beagle, who's super hyper and gets into lots of trouble, um, she Sunday night, I noticed that uh, her tail is usually st sticking straight up like a Beagle. And I stolen, and I thought for sure I was going to have to take her into the vet. And I was like, did she break it? Like, wh what is going on with her tail? Um, and she yelped when I touched it. So she was in pain. 
And I went ahead and dissolved two SLD, two STP, and two RLX before we went to bed Sunday night. And yesterday morning, got up and it's normal. It's sticking up. Um, she doesn't yelp when I touch it. There's still some swelling, some obvious swelling going on. So I'm continuing giving her those drops. Um, but it definitely saved a vet bill <laughs> for us this week. So I love that these are safe for everyone in our family, including our pets. I love that. Thank you so much, Jen. And we're just so happy with your progress and everything that you're about and being so transparent too. Sometimes with addictions, it's hard to talk about it. So thank you so much. I know you're always willing to share some of Absolutely. those. Absolutely. Happy, happy birthday. <laughs> thank you. Oh, we have some good ones. Uh, Melinda, would you yeah. like to share? Sure. Um, the drop that got me started was PFT. And um, I, I started taking them. And along with that, I also took power apricot. And uh, oh my goodness, the difference in uh, two months, I took them for two months. I didn't really say much to my husband about what I was doing. I just started taking these drops. <laughs> and all of a sudden he comes to me one day and he's like, what is different with you? Something's going on. <laughs> and my moods were balanced. I wasn't up and down like a roller coaster. I I had energy like I've never had before. I have severe arthritis in both of my knees. So I can't stand for very long. And I was in the kitchen making these full meals. And he comes in and is like, what is going on? How are you even standing here? And in the first two months of taking the PFT, I lost 27 pounds and two inches off of everything. So my waist, my hips, my arms, and I, the, the weight coming off is helping my arthritis so much that I can actually move around and get around. I mean, it still hurts obviously, but it's so much less than it was. I mean, I was just practically just crippled, couldn't hardly move and and I'm still continuing to lose the weight and it's just, I just love them. <laughs> Those are my two that I, I promote quite regularly because I couldn't believe the difference with the power apricot and just, just how much better I felt about life. <laughs> yeah. And when you feel better, what happens is you start, like you said, you start moving more, you oh. start doing more. I'm sure that's just all helping with your weight loss. I remember when we met and you told me that and then I was like, wow, you know what I mean? That's what I said, our products, you just never know what it's going to do for your unique body and cells and giving you, Melinda, what you probably were lacking with the hormonal, the you know, the yes. thyroid, the weight. Yes. Uh, so thank you for sh for sharing that. And your journey is just beginning, right? It's yep. just yep. a progression. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We're excited to have Dana. you with us. Yes. Dina. Yes. My name is Sue Abden, and I am on my son Ethan's computer, so I see I am Ethan. Oh, Ethan okay. Him, but I am Sue. Okay, perfect, Sue. Do you have a, a favorite drop or experience that you'd like to share? I accidentally muted her, so you'll need to unmute yourself, Sue. Oh. Sue, unmute, unmute yourself, Sue. You're muted. There you go. Sorry about that. No, oh. you're still muted. No, she's muted again. Oh. <laughs> Great, now there you go. Okay. Are. And um, just because of depression, and that runs a lot in my family. And so I ended up sending my sister the happy, and then the nurse took it away from her until she met with her doctor. And I was just so aggravated. I just wanted to call them all and say, hey, they said there was like <laughs> alcohol in there and she couldn't take it. And I'm like, shooby dooby, I am just so aggravated. And so then uh, she went for her treatment yesterday and she met with the doctor. And so she called me and she said, Sue, he said that these are for uh, depression. And yes, I can take them. So I'm like, yay, thank you, Jesus. I was so excited for her and for, you know, and they, and they have just helped me with multiple things. I really feel great most of the time, but I started taking them because I took the big handful of vitamins every day. And so, and a protein drink and, you know, the, and the honey, local honey for the allergies. And so I did that every morning. And then Dr. Cooper sent me the samples 
And I started taking them and I'm thinking, hey, this is wonderful. They taste wonderful. I don't have to take that big old, you know, those horse pills anymore. And then my legs started feeling better. And they, I really, they just only bothered me when I go to bed at night. They'd just be a little bit achy, not super bad. But, and I quit babysitting for my daughter, who is a nurse practitioner, because I was falling asleep reading to the girls. And so they said, Mimo, you are falling asleep. And I'm like, Suzanne, so you'll can you want get, to be in can you get the other Friday. grandma to watch them so that, you know, I'm falling asleep reading to them. So she did. And so I know that was nine years ago. So my legs were just a little bit achy for like nine years. And I started taking these and my legs aren't achy anymore. And then I started sweating. I have never sweat my whole life, hardly at all. And I'm like, thank you, Jesus. This is wonderful. I'm sweating. And then I noticed that I am not motion sickness hardly at all like I used to be. So just time and time again, just different things that I didn't really think I had hardly any issues that they have just, it has improved lots of things for me. So I'm so thankful. Yeah. Thank you for that share, Sue. And and welcome to APL Go. And I'm sure it's going to get better. Like you said, it's just these little things, you know, you start to feel these improvements in your health. And you're right. Who wants to swallow horse pills? Right. Nobody, nobody does. I always, say, I always say swallowing pills. Yeah. So last year, like, <laughs> <doesn't put> <laughs> or they don't have to, they just don't know. They don't have to. And so. Sue, Nancy said, hi, she, she's working with the girls tonight, but she says, if Sue gets on there, say hi to her. Okay. We'll say hi to Nancy. Yeah. Everybody's just been such a blessing to me and just such, so much help. I appreciate everybody. Oh, yeah. you're, you're a great member of the team. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I think, I don't know if, if Patty can share or not, Patty LeBaron, I know you had a couple of things you wanted to speak about. You'll have to unmute. Did I? There you go. I'm here with Sherry. <laughs> and <laughs> say hi. Oh, wow. <laughs> making a vision board <laughs> love it well I'm sure, go. I'm sure you and your 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 group of people there might have a few apl go drop stories to share let's ask sherry if she would like to share <laughs> That's fine, sherry. Oh. did you unmute yourself okay click on it right here there you go okay she's unmuted i'll make myself <laughs> Okay, so I started on these drops about April 20th because Patty did a, if you'll come and be in a video to advertise my r, &R wellness place, you can have a foot soak and you get a box of these drops. So I thought, well, I'm in for free stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I had a lot of problems physically um, for a lot of years, a lot of pain. Tried a lot of different products, tried a lot of different everything that anybody said, oh, this will help. So when they were talking about these drops, I thought, yeah, right. Candy's going to make you feel better. Sure. <laughs> tell me another one. But I got my free box of um, SLD because when I read this stuff, it talked about inflammation. And I thought, well, I'll try that. And, and I bought a box of the um, STD. STP, excuse me. <laughs> it's been a long day. Mm -hmm. And I went home and started eating candy. Now, I didn't expect anything, really. <laughs> so when after, and you know, I did not ration it. It tasted good, so I just kept eating it. In about two days, I was able to get up off of my bed with out the excruciating pain that I have been in for a lot of years. And I went, oh. So I came back in when uh, Tina and Norita came up to do a class um, on it. I wanted to know more about the science because it just didn't really make sense. I had a really, really busy day, so I didn't get a lot of time to learn that day, but I do have to say that when people are ready to give up, sometimes there really is something out there 
Um, and I, I don't think that it's an exaggeration when I say that part of my trouble, I think I was afraid. I thought I would probably be in a wheelchair by the end of the year because just walking was very, very painful. I could not go up and down stairs without walk, doing it like a two-year-old, holding onto the wall, going sideways. My knees and ankles were so bad and so swollen. But any tests or I go to the doctor and help me figure this out. And they're like, there's nothing wrong with you. There is something so mentally debilitating when somebody looks and says, there's nothing wrong with you. And yet you cannot function as a human being. And everybody says, you just need to relax. People quit being so stressed. It took me a month of being on these and people saying, you look so much better. And I said, you know, it's amazing how much better you look when you're not in abject and when you're not in pain all the time. Sometimes stress isn't the stress they think it is. Sometimes the stress is the pain etching on the face. Sure. And in the everyday life. So I, I am very grateful for the opportunity to... Um, experience this and know that there is something out there that is <laughs> simple it is really simple hmm. i've taken um all sorts of different supplements i've tried i can't assimilate most things because i've got digestive issues but i've tried the best about everything out there and it was not it was not bettering my life hmm. and these make it so i can think i can move I I have hope again. So that's the story right now. Thank you, Sherry. I I didn't even hear that full story. Thank you. That was very powerful. Did you guys I felt yes. that? Yeah. Uh, I couldn't Definitely. imagine living in chronic pain. I, I don't know how people do it. But the fact that we have solutions, like you said, that if you've tried everything, maybe try this. Sherry, which drops did you uh, did you find that you were using that 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 made that big that big jump of a difference? Um, the ones that I started with were just the ones that I got here at her um, at the SLD and S S T P, um, and because it was like really, um, when I came in and Norita she said anybody who signed up she would match it. Because I don't have a lot of funding right now, I, I quit my. I ended up quitting my full time job um, last spring because I could not function. I could not be around. I worked at a, a junior high. <laughs> you cannot afford to make mistakes when you're dealing with other people's children. I don't care how much pain you're in. <laughs> it's never a good good thing. Um, so I started with those, and then worried it. So I signed up, and I got the. Um, I think it was uh, one of the kits because I wanted to try um, some of the other ones, mostly for the liver, because due to the fact that when I'm in a lot of pain over the years, I would take over-the-counter um, pain meds and my liver was in really, really bad trouble. So um, I've been doing the HPR. I like the happy and the relax. And, you know, I just have it set out there. I make sure I take the ones for pain and then I just pick them out of my box. Um, yeah. How, whatever I feel like I need. Um, so sometimes I, I need the H, I need the happy ones. If I'm struggling, um, sometimes I'm like, well, today I feel like this, but I, I carry them with me yeah. and I just eat candy all day. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> A lot of people don't know. I says, oh, I'm just eating candy. Yeah. Well, and the but gut I don't get out is much. so related. The gut is so related. Like liver and gut and detox is so related to nerve pain and general pain. I don't even think people put two to two together. So like when Kevin asked that, you know, start with the symptoms, but then work on some of the underlying issues. Yeah. So I, I have been taking more of them. Um, like I say, I don't, I haven't decided on a regimen. I just, if I feel like something's going to help me that day, that's what I eat. Okay. For a while, do that for a few days. And... You know, Sherry, that, that's, to that's totally great. You know what? And, and that's a perfect way to approach it. Um, 
I want a clip of I want to take a clip of your your testimony there because you know we all get asked well what should I start with what should I do I don't I, you know and and you just approached it from a very well I'm just going to give this thing a try and not really stress out over it and it worked for you and I think if more people take that approach it just just takes the pressure off and it makes the whole process that much easier so well done for that share thank you yeah great share thank you Sherry I for the sake of time I would love maybe just a couple more testimonials. I know since it's Father's Day and a bunch of stuff coming up in June, we have Power Lemon uh, that you know we like to focus on. Has anyone had a great testimonial on that one? I can do that one. Okay, I can do that one. Brenda. Yeah, we're off the hook, Bob. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, about, it's for women about a, too. <laughs> yes, about a year ago, uh, one of our team members had said um, that she used the power lemon and for um, UTIs. And I had gotten those regularly. And so I started taking it and it's been over a year. I've not had a UTI. The other one I would like to talk about is grow. Mm -hmm. Thanks to Kevin. I, as many of you know, I, I have come through cancer as a survivor but I take grow because I'm so immunocompromised and I'm still taking it. I take two a day, sometimes three. If I'm going to be in a big crowd or something, I'll just go ahead and take extra. Love the taste of it. Not as good as brain, but I love the taste of the grape. And um, I, I think that's really, when I was going through the cancer, the chemo and everything, I took almost all the drops. But And I think they all helped in different ways. But I think the grow probably was one of my biggest helps in not getting sick with other things. So I got through it. Yeah, that yeah. one's but great. But the power lemon definitely worked for the UTIs. Yeah, women women have testosterone too, even though we, we call it like the, the men's hormonal support. Uh, it's a great one for everyone. Like you said, UTIs, there's just a great urinary health. And then who can't go without immune support nowadays with everything yeah. that's out there and we're exposed to and grow air, right? Air is great for an another great antiviral, antibacterial. We have so much goodness here. I, I know we could talk about this all night long. Uh, we might have time for one more. Would anyone kind of like to, to end it? Anyone that hasn't got to speak up, now is your chance. I have a few people with their cameras off. That's fine. If you want to unmute. No? You know, the power of men's, I just had thought, what if they did an experiment and had ladies take just power lemon and see if they have more male children? <laughs> Or apricots, see if they have more female children. I wonder. You never know. Science is weird, you know. I, you got to edit that part out. Yeah, I might have to edit a few things out, actually. Uh, <laughs> we have had some on the, uh, we have had some great testimonials on the power apricot for fertility. I wish Dixie was on okay. to talk about, you know, being a midwife. Yes. Uh, I believe it was. Patty even shared with me someone's result about how they had been infertile for 10 years and took wow. our apricot for one or two months and um, had like a cycle. Like they had literally were just not like even fun functioning as a female in that way. And I'm like, wow, can you imagine right, oh to, to have that kind of result after trying everything for 10 years? Be interesting to see if if the power for lemon would have uh, a similar effect on men. I don't see why not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just it's see, just... now you're getting close to my points. <laughs> oh. You never know. <laughs> you never know. Absolutely. So thank you all for sharing tonight. Um, I share, you know, here and there, so I didn't feel like I needed to do much sharing um, in our other overviews that we do, but. Whoever shared this video with you, if you would get back with whoever uh, shared these amazing results, they'll be more than happy to, to help you with any of the products, make some recommendations, even try it, sample it. Uh, it, it 
why not right if if you're yeah. tired of the pills powder shakes the traditional supplementations i really believe we have a solution that solves anything um, when it comes to any type of symptoms or uh, anything related to just traditional supplementation itself so anyway get back with whoever invited you to learn more and we just appreciate you watching this video and, and learning with us tonight you know can i ask